Next topic natin is about insulation resistance of cable. So, for example, meron tayong wire. Meron tayong wire. So, familiar na nakikita naman na kayo ng wire. So, ang inner, inner, uh, inner, itong inner niya is copper. Then, yung sa outside. So, so ito yung inner, RI. So, yung inner niya is copper. Saka yung RO is the outside diameter. So, RI means inish, uh, inner diameter, ay, uh, inner radius. RI is inner radius and the uh, RO is outer radius. So, where R is the insulation resistance of cable. Then, P is resistivity of insulating material. So, ang unit niya is ohm meter. Ito is ohm. Yung L is length ng cable. So, yung haba. Then, RI is the inner radius. So, ito. Inner radius. Then, RO is the outer surface radius. So, ang formula niya is R is equals to P over 2 pi L. LN. So, ang LN is ito natural logarithm ln uh, r outside over the r inside so uh, memoryahin nyo to so, for example meron tayong problem uh, a certain wire has a conductor with a diameter of 0.5 inch and thickness of 0.15 insulation uh, wrap around the conductor if the specific resistance uh, of the insulation is known to be uh, 1 times 10 raised to 14 ohm centimeter so what is the insulation resistance uh, per foot length of the wire so ang formula na so formula niya is ito so P over uh, resistance is equals to P over 2 pi L Ln of R outside over the R inside so ang length niya is uh, 1000 feet so convert natin sa centimeter so 100 centimeter is uh, 3.281 feet So, it's equals to 30, 478.5 centimeter. Then, ang R inside. So, sabi dito, a certain wire has a conductor. So, conductor means yan yung copper. Yan yung copper. Yan yung uh, R inside. So, since diameter, so D over 2 is equals to 0.50 over 2. So, 0.25 inch then ang R outside is equals to uh, R inside plus T so sana nabi dito uh, 0.15 insulation wrap so 0.15 yan yung kapal ng yan yung kapal ng uh, insulation so kung babalikan natin ang thickness sa so sinabi yung thickness ito, yung thickness ito lang yun mula dito sa Mula dito, yan yung thickness ng wire, so uh, thickness of the insulation. So, so, kay, uh, so kailangan mong, uh, para makuha mo yung RO, para makuha mo yung RO, so kailangan mo yung R inside plus thickness. So, RO is equal to RI plus T, so 0.25 plus 0.15 uh, inch then yung ano nya is uh, resistivity is 1 times 10 raised to 14 ohm centimeter
So, kompleto na yung given natin. So, sub, uh, substitution na. So, R is equals to P over 2 pi L, LN of RO over RI. So, is equal to, so, 1 times 10 raised to 14 ohm centimeter uh, over so 2 pi L. So, ano yung L is uh, 30 for 78.51 centimeter. So, LN 0.40 over uh, 0.25 inch. So, ito yung Tingnan natin itong RI saka RO. So, hindi na natin kinonvert kasi uh, same unit naman sila. So, same unit, uh, makakancel to. So, no need na mag-convert. Tapos, itong uh, ohm centimeter, yung resistivity niya. So, ohm, ohm centimeter. So, two, P over 2 pi L. So, ito, ohm centimeter. So, yung L, kailangan mo uh, i-convert sa centimeter kaya nag-convert tayo so pag same unit na sila cancel na yan so ang matitira kung mapansin nyo is ohm so meaning tama yung solution so r is equals to, to uh, r is equals to 2.45 times 10 raised to 8 uh, ohm so times 10 raised to 8 so meaning uh, high resistance so meaning uh, insulation resistance ang kinukuha natin pag uh, high resistance Well, pag sa conductor, sa conductor naman is low resistance sa mga point, ano lang yun, point something. So, next is uh, conductance. So, ang conductance is the uh, measure of materials or the ability to conduct electric current. So, it is equal to the reciprocal of the resistance. So, kinukuha natin dito is uh, conductivity. So, ang, so, sabi dito, R is the, ay, conductance is the reciprocal ng resistance. So, para sa pagkuha ng conductance, so, kailangan muna natin makuha yung resistance. Tapos, uh, raise natin sa negative 1. So, Siemens or firm, uh, firmly mo, uh, unit of conductance. So, ang unit of conductance is mo. Named after German engineer Ernest Wemer van Siemens. So, ito yung formula ng conductance. So, G. So, G ang formula ng conductance is equals to uh, 1 over R. So, 1 over R, yan yung reciprocal ng resistance. So, is equals to, so, conductivity times the area over L. Then, yung conductivity is 1 over the uh, specific resistance. So, ito na yung mga uh, units, uh, yun yung mga given sa kaya units niya. So, conductivity is Siemens per meter. Then, L is uh, length in meter. Area is cross-sectional area. Uh, meter squared. Then, P is the specific resistance of meter. Then, then G is the conductance. So, Siemens or Mo. Then, R is the resistance. So, Sample problem, uh, board exam to, uh, the resistance of uh, 120 meter of wire is 12 ohm. So, what is the conductance? So, remember, ang conductance is the reciprocal ng resistance. So, so ito, pampalito lang tong 120 meter na to. Although, meron naman siya dito sa formula. So, since nakuha na yung resistance, makukuha mo na yung conductance. So, G is equals to 1 over R is equals to 1 over 12. So, input niyan, G is equals to point, uh, point 0.0833 mo. So, tandaan, so, summary ha, sa pagkuha ng conductance, kailangan mo lang kunin yung resistance. So, G is equals to 1 over R or, same lang yan sa same lang sa, sa R raised to negative 1 by loss of exponent. Ulitin natin na sa pagkuha ng uh, conductance, importante lang dyan is yung resistance. So, pag nakaman ng resistance is, oh, makukuha mo na, gamitin mo itong formula na ito, makukuha mo na yung conductance. Pero kung hindi yung, hindi given yung resistance, 
So, gagamitin mo tong formula na to. Ito. May length, saka may area yung wire. Then, mayroong conductivity. So, mukha mo na yung conductance. 